Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Janice. Today, I will share with you how to actually install Windows 11. Huh? Uh, if your PC doesn't meet the minimum system requirement. See my PC? It says that my PC doesn't meet the minimum requirement to run Windows 11. How do I actually uh, go in to install Windows 11 despite the warning that uh, my, my laptop uh, doesn't meet the Windows 11 installation requirement because uh, Windows 10 is actually ending the support this month, October. So yeah, I am thinking uh, what to do. I need uh, to have security updates. Uh, if not uh, for support and all that for Windows. So I was thinking how to actually go about doing that. Uh, I did a check out for example, like, let me show you my Windows 11 system requirement doesn't meet Okay, you put there, you know, find your specs requirements Actually, I was looking through, right? Uh, my system should be able to meet, this is the system requirement for Windows 11 Requirement, but mine is actually a AMD uh, chipset, which is a first generation uh, chip set yeah so it doesn't compatible even though i made the ram and made the processor speed and the storage limit and all that okay so basically this is a windows 11 requirement and i don't meet all of them uh yeah so i need to by the way this is the website to download the uh, windows 11 uh okay well, how do you install uh this, you need to go to this website i'll put it in the link description how to download the windows 11 okay this this link okay click on not this tool i want you to choose this download windows 11 this image iso okay for x64 devices Click on this to download and confirm. Okay. Click confirm. And uh, to see which languages you need to go to the time and language section in the region to select the language. Okay. You need to select your languages, which language you want to use. First of all, you need to check your Windows. Uh, uh, what language are you currently using in your Windows? How do you go about checking it? Uh? Okay, how do you go about checking it? Uh, you need to go to CMD. CMD, uh, as admin. And then paste this text, this text over here. Okay, this text. So, let's go and uh, CMD. Come on, Bron. Run, run, run as administrator run as administrator okay run as administrator okay run as administrator and then i'm going to paste this i'm going to paste uh, copy this and put it in the description as well for you guys to copy and then paste it over here Control v paste enter then oh, you can see that my system is uh, English US okay, English US version okay yeah so mainly English US version uh. I've got other languages as well so basically uh, I'm going to install the English language version for you guys you need to find out what language you are then you choose I'm going to choose the English US and then click confirm it will take some time to actually download the file. For me, I already download the file. Okay, uh, yeah, it's about 7.2 gig. Lah. But anyway, I already download the file. Okay, just click this to download. And save it. It's 7.2 gig. I already download the file. Okay, I already download the file. Huh? So it's actually in my the my drive here 
Okay, once you download, right? I need you to actually mount it. Right click your mouse, mount it. Okay, mount it. Uh. Then you open it. Mount it as a DVD drive. Okay, now I want you go to go to download uh, tips to fix the uh, Windows 11 installation. Uh, yeah, how to fix it? Go to this GitHub URL. Okay, go to this GitHub URL, which I'm already here. Okay, which I'm already here. And yeah, this tips to Windows. Okay, this URL. I want you to actually download the this installer. Uh, get the zip file. Download the zip file. Okay, download the zip. Okay, download the zip. I want you to extract it. Okay, extract it. And then I want you to right click this uh, run installer.bat as an administrator. Okay, mouse run as administrator. Run. Yes. I'm blown. Yeah, I'm blown. Okay. Back up a first file in installation on unsupported hardware is risky. So back as your backup. You can choose uh files install, no up upgrade. No registry you did or advanced install apply bypass register you did or reset register. I'm going to tr use the fast install. And then you go to the folder where you get your where you uh, download. Okay. Download the Windows 11. Uh, ISO uh, which we get just now from Microsoft yes proceed now it so now it's extracting the ISO files Yeah, I think now it's speeding up. Session complete. Okay, now it's mostly the one start Windows 11 setup. Yes. Installation start successful and join Windows 11. Okay, preparing. It's Donix getting update. Checking your PC. Okay, application notice. Some license and all those things that they accept or decline or just accept. Keep all, I'm going to keep all my files, settings and apps. Okay, check it for updates. Getting updates it will take a while. Complete. Meanwhile, uh, do like and subscribe to my channel for more uh, useful Windows uh, tips and IT tips. It's almost ready to install. Okay, 
ready install uh, keep all so click install installing your PC will restart a few times Okay, this should be able to install the Windows 11, should be able to go through. Okay, my laptop actually has actually restarted and rebooted. Uh, I'm now showing my laptop screen because uh, earlier I'm actually using the monitor, uh, yeah, the bigger monitor to show and it actually started so uh, let's wait for it to run through it will take a while to complete the installation the, yeah to do the update is actually updating it may restart a few times you need to be patient to get the windows 11 installation to be done It's about to be ready soon. Okay, almost uh, complete. Should be starting soon. Okay, please wait. Please wait. Uh, uh, should be able to install the Windows uh, 11. Okay, we are in the login screen. Okay, login screen. Hey, let me log in. Okay, let me log in. Uh, yeah. Right, okay, now it's showing hi. Getting things ready for you. This might take a few minutes. Uh, don't turn off uh, your PC. Give me one to click the like and subscribe uh, to my channel for more uh, that tips, windows, uh, videos, tutorials. And you guys, uh, if you have any other uh, videos uh, you want to see, please put in the comment section as well. Okay, now it's showing. Please keep your PC on and plug in. Don't turn off your PC. Okay. And good things coming your way. Don't off, turn off your PC. Okay, almost done. Almost there, almost there. Right, now it's put that into Windows uh, screen, Windows 11 screen. So there you go, Windows is able to install Windows 11. But my there's a problem saying that my AMD software is not compatible and all that. Okay, 
Okay, we're going to explore around. Uh, see, is it working well? Uh, Firefox browser. Mm, it seems like taking a while. My Word document, doing some tests. Yeah, what is able to load? Firefox, it seems like it's taking quite a while. Okay, now it's loading. See the Chrome. Chrome is faster. Uh, loading. No, look at the files. Uh, Explorer. There you go, uh, Windows 11 is able to work well. Okay, installation. Uh, but uh, anyway, I actually re uh, reported after this video, I actually uh, recording right after this video recording, I actually reported it's a lot better to for the Windows 11 to report to get the update done, installation complete because it's still in the background of installing and uh, yeah, and it's a lot faster the Firefox is actually uh, faster that's all so uh, if you like the video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching, bye